This is a project I've been working on recently. This is called a Magic Eye Tube, also known as a 6E5 tube. These were used a long time ago in radios to indicate how well you were tuned in to a certain radio station. So if you look, there's this sort of uh, shadow uh, in this, this little wedge here. And the rest of this is all lit up green, and that little shadow will get narrower or wider depending on how closely you were tuned in to a certain station. Uh, these were also called cat's eye tubes for obvious reasons. And sometimes idiot lamps, uh, because I guess you'd have to be an idiot to use one of these to tune your radio. I'm not really sure. But um, I'll, I've got this hooked up to an audio source, so let me turn it on here. You can sort of see how it works. You can see I'm having to shield it right now because there's a window over to my left, and these don't work very well in the light. I'm not sure if the music will come through on this video or not, but... Um, so the basic operation of these things is actually pretty simple. It's essentially a cathode ray tube, so just like an old TV or monitor used to be. Uh, here's a good diagram I found that describes it. Um, let's see if that gets in focus. So essentially, it's set up uh, similar to how most other vacuum tubes are, but at the top, there's this sort of cone that's coated in zinc silicate, which is uh, which will phosphoresce whenever electrons hit it. So this uh, little electrode right here is what actually controls the width of that shadow. And so as it gets more and more negative, then it repels electrons that are being fired at this surface, and so there's a shadow there because they can't hit. And then as it gets more positive, or I guess less negative, then um, the electrons will be able to hit that part of the display and light it up. So it kind of looks like the entire thing should light up, or should uh, uh, move, but really just this little section does. The reason there's that black dot in the middle is because the heater right there glows red, and so if that wasn't there, then uh, a lot of this green display would get uh, washed out by that red. Uh, so anyway, it's a pretty neat little tube. There are some other ones too. Uh, I have some other shapes here. Um, this is a bar graph. And this is some kind of weird, like, scoop shape. There was a couple other different shapes of uh, Magic Eye tubes. I haven't hooked these up yet because I don't have the right socket for them. But they operate on similar principles. So anyway... That is the Magic Eye Tube. Um, it's a pretty neat and somewhat forgotten piece of old technology.